hello Capricorn and welcome to your singles reading for July. So if you're single, this reading is for you. I've also done a general reading and a twin flame reading for you, so you may want to check them out. But right now we're going to tap in with two powerful decks of cards to see what's coming in for you. So thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. So we're going to use the Archangel Power Tarot for this reading and the power of love. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know, please? For single Capricorns for this month, what do we need to know? For single Capricorns. It's already going to be a really powerful month for you, Capricorn, because, you know, you've been enlightened this month. You're going through a lot of energy upgrades and you're finding yourself again. So something magical is coming in, especially in love, because I feel you're connecting with that special person. So if you're a twin flame, you're connecting, whether it be on the 3D realm, the 5D realm, in dreams, telepathically. But if you're single and you're wanting love, you're manifesting it right now. And that's bringing in power and it's bringing in happiness. And we've got the sun energy here, Archangel Uriel. So Archangel Uriel is enlightening you this month to know that great love is ahead, that everything you want is flowing in, that you're on the right path right now, that you're moving forward towards a better future. You're being enriched in love and power and warmth and comfort energy. Life is wonderful. Thrive through the power of positive thinking. You are an inspiring success. So I feel you've been doing a lot of work on you and because of that you've been rising up and you've been shown here that you are an inspiration to others, an inspiring success. So it's also signifying here great power and you know great rewards coming in in work life and on your purpose, your mission. You're feeling better. You're feeling renewed. So July is going to be a month of renewal for you and you're feeling better. If you've been through any struggles, you're coming out the other side, you're feeling better because you're trusting and having faith in yourself and the universe and you're tapping in to this positive thought. So your thinking is becoming more positive, more enlightened, more in touch with who you truly are. And if you're a divine feminine, you're truly in your goddess empress energy. But Capricorn, this is showing you the power of the earth around you. You connect and thrive to the earth and it uplifts you. It gives you power. And you're being guided to spend time in nature this month to tap into that power. Especially if you feel like you're losing your voice. <clears throat> They're just giving me a little bit of blocked throat chakra there, feeling like I need to clear the throat. So I feel your throat chakra has been healed and cleansed and cleared this month so that you can speak from your heart. You know, ask for what you want so you can set clear intentions and boundaries and operate from a place of power within you, but also a place of peace. So when you go into nature, and you're connecting with the trees and the earth and the soil and, you know, even the sky and the, the air that you're breathing in, you feel power. So this is your sign to go outdoors this month. And the angel's saying it's time to act upon your plans. So something's being generated for you. And this is moving you towards love, but towards the life of your dreams. There's power coming in creativity is rewarded so anything you're creating right now you're going to see the rewards luxurious or abundant resources so things are going to be magically appear and i love that because in the general reading it was all about that you know things coming to you giving and receiving because you're in that energy of power and we've got kindness and kindness works because the more kind you are, the more blessings you receive. Even at times when we feel like when we're kind, we get walked on or we're a bit vulnerable. Well, the angels are showing you here that your kindness is bringing in everything you're asking for, everything you desire, because you've got the power of the sun around you guiding you on. So your kindness gives you strength. You are a humanitarian made of love and you are able to share that energy with others. So you're in your power when you're helping and guiding others, connecting with who you are, feeling good. So you're also a guide for others, showing you that you are an empath, a light worker. You're tapped in and tuned in with what's going on. And this is going to be a great month of satisfaction. And Archangel Raphael's energy is their healing. 
So you've been through a lot of healing on your journey and you've found yourself again and you're feeling satisfied, possibly for the first time in a long time because you finally know where you're going and who you are. And you might not have all the answers. You might not have the direction yet, but you know that you are safe and protected. You let the energy of love guide you to self-approval so that others no longer define who you are. And you've had to learn that Capricorn, you know, from the things you've been through. And you've stood your ground, you've moved into power and you've set boundaries and you know who you are. You've worked on self-worth and healing, self-respect, you know who you are and you stand your ground so nobody can hurt you anymore. Not without your permission anyway, because you're cooperating with the universe and you're speaking to heaven and you're asking for what you want and you've been setting these clear intentions. In your quest to manifest the energy of love, you realize that every person and every experience has value. So you're taking stock of what you've done and all the relationships you've been through, all the situations, all the things that have challenged you throughout your life, it's made you who you are and you've gained so much experience and so much love. So you're understanding now that everyone in your life has a reason and there's a reason why everyone's been in your life in the past. So you're accepting things, appreciating things and feeling grateful because you're cooperating with who you are. So you're tapping in and you're also manifesting and creating through this energy. You can resolve any challenge. Anything you're going through this month, you've got this and heaven has got you. You've got the Midas touch this month. You've been successful. There's things flowing to you. And the angels are saying to you, withdraw from the drama of others. So you don't need that around you anymore. And you've got a very clear idea in your mind now about the kind of relationships you want in your life. Whether this be with a lover or with friends, family. You don't need drama around you moving away from that energy right now. And you need to have patience, to have patience to be able to bring in what you want at the right time. Have patience so you trust in divine timing and the power of love and the power of synchronicity and that everything has been orchestrated perfectly just for you. So have patience with yourself, but more importantly, with the journey that you're on. And with those around you, trusting and knowing that everything is happening at the right time for the right reasons. So if you overthink anything this month, this is a sign to go out in nature, to balance your energy, to have more time for you, to come back into the now. Because this card came out in the other reading for you. And I really do feel balance coming in, needing to go in nature. You know, you may be doing too much at once and you know, you're overthinking things, making work fun. So the angels say, make everything you're doing fun. You know, whether you're at work or you're at home, make it all fun, make your life fun. Because the more fun you have, the better things become. And you're receiving all the guidance you need this month to move you forward. So I really do feel you focused this month, focused on who you are, what you're learning, searching for a meaning of life. And the angels are saying to you, you're already doing it. You're exactly where you're meant to be. There's change going on in your life, but you're finding your way. The search for the meaning in life. Consider an alternative approach. Surround yourself with wise teachers or friends. So the answer to your prayers right now is to go within, to receive the guidance, being around people that are of power and optimism and positivity people who get you, not people who try and drag you down or put you into drama or any negativity. So you're taking an alternative approach, you're finding yourself this month and you're ready for what's to come. Your heart's healing. You're ready for new experiences and new things. Seek out other possibilities. Look for the magic in life and be aware of your own emotions because the way you feel is always telling you something about what you're going through and how you're feeling and what you feel is always real and you know how you feel by how it affects your physical body you know if something's right for you and you know if something's off by the way you feel so the angels saying trust in your physical feelings this month the way you feel is always real and it will guide you forward and archangel Raphael is right by your side healing you 
And the angels are saying to you, Capricorn, I know you've been through pain and you've built yourself up. You've got so strong through all the things you've endured. But the angels are assuring you a better future is coming. The sky is being removed, this grey, the air is clearing so the sun can come out because the sun is coming out, okay, the sun, where, there we go, so it's showing you, it's blessing you, and they show me the energy in this card of 2019, so in 2019, something happened for you, either a big awakening, a big change, or a challenge, or something you went through that's moving you towards where you're meant to be, moving you towards love, and the angels are showing you love is coming, so it's all worth waiting for, it's in divine time and it's coming forward. So if you're watching this because you're wanting love, it's showing, it's coming to you. Maybe you've met someone new and you're wondering if it's going to progress. Or maybe you're a twin flame wanting your divine masculine. Well, whatever situation you're in, the angels are showing you that Archangel Raphael is bringing this in. All the healing is going on now to bring in love. So this is about a committed, romantic, beautiful relationship, making choices from your heart, following your heart, the power of love. And that's the deck I'm using as well. And obviously it's not, you know, this is in a different deck here, but it's showing you the power of love. So trust in love. And you haven't given up on love, Capricorn, because you're in this energy of power. So trust that this is coming. The universe wants to give it to you and it wants to give it to you soon. So trust that love is on the horizon and it's going to be a deep commitment, something beautiful, something emotional, something that will nurture you and enrich your soul because you've been doing all the work on self-love, all the healing, all the growth that you need to do to bring in what's meant for you. So a beautiful month of love for you, happiness, power, strength, responsibility and coping with everything that's thrown at you because you're strong and you can overcome all things once you go in nature and connect with who you truly are because you are an earth angel and the angels want you to know that today. Have a beautiful month sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.